this man, we, we've never had him on the show before. I, I haven't really seen you appear at WonderCon before. How, how are you doing? I'm pretty good. I'm pretty good. Is this uh, your first convention, or have you done no, this? No, I don't do this very often. This is my first one in two years. Oh, yep. Because yeah, we haven't had the pleasure of your company before. So uh, tell us a little bit about your experiences uh, making Star Wars. How did you get the part, first of all? I cast for it, and I got it. So when you were working on the film, did you get this uh, sense of history, like, wow, I'm part of this iconic franchise? Oh, my gosh. Absolutely. You know, it's, it wasn't just me. I think everyone involved in the film on set had this sense of being in a film which was larger than anything they would ever possibly because it was being a part of history. It was being part of movie history. What else have you been working on besides Star Wars? I have a film being released in a few months. It's called The Birth of a Warrior. Cool. Mm. And I have two more films being shot this is year. Is that like martial arts oriented? Uh, it is martial arts. Cool. I play a wise person. What did you do before Star Wars? Is there anything that people would know you from? Mission Impossible. Mission Impossible. Uh, but you know, one of the works which I'm which is most precious to me. And precious in, 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 you know, like you remember most of all was Moby Dick. Nice. Which I did with um, Patrick Stewart. Patrick Stewart, a great actor. How cool is that to act with him? He's a very cool guy. Very nice. Pleasure meeting with you, sir. Well, thank you so much.